Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm here in Colmar, France. I'm going to show you one of the most beautiful Christmas markets in all of Europe. Sounds very exciting, let's explore it together. So first, being partially French myself, I would like to explain you a little bit more about this region. Alsace, in German Alsace, is a very unique region in France. It is well known for its many heritage villages and cities, foodie culture and being the home to some of the most beautiful Christmas markets in the world. The native people of Alsace, they speak Ilsassisch and it's very similar to Swiss German, particular to the dialect spoken in Basel. Alsace is a melting pot of local French and German culture. And this can be seen from the many wood frame houses that are also very common in northern Switzerland and southern Germany. But then there are also many boards and signs and you'll notice the names, they actually do not sound too French. So, as I mentioned, this is because Elsässisch is not a French language, it's Hochalemanisch, that is a subcategory of German languages. Colmar is one of the most visited towns in Alsace. This is because of its preserved old city with its many historical houses. Colmar's Christmas market is one of the most beautiful and famous one in all of Europe. In my opinion, that's very well deserved. So, if you're a Christmas market lover, this one is considered a must visit. Now, why that is so, I'm going to explain you throughout this video. The Christmas market of Colmar is throughout the entire old city. At various places you will see markets, which I find quite exciting, as upon your visit to the Christmas market, you will need to explore the historic part of Colmar. There again a lot of stalls. It's really nice, you can see a lot of Christmassy items and also you can buy a lot of foods, especially things from here, from Alsace. And yeah, what I really like about Colmar is there are of course many beautiful Christmas markets all around, but then also all the buildings are really beautifully decorated. After you have seen my various videos about the Swiss Christmas markets, you'll be familiar with the many artisan goods and traditional international foods being sold. Pretty much the same as the case in Colmar and the markets in Alsace. Now a major difference lays in the foods being sold. Alsace has its own cuisine, especially with its Tarte Flambé, while in Switzerland the focus is more on raclette and fondue. Also the stalls in Switzerland they look a little bit like small alpine chalets, while in Colmar they are rather bold to better fit into the local environment. As you keep exploring the city, you will once in a while discover interesting details, decorated houses or fancy Christmas trees. So here we have a little bit of a different kind of Christmas tree. It's made of skis. And yeah, I find this is a very cool approach. It looks very nice. And well, if you're not very familiar with France, actually the French people are known for their creativity, especially when it comes to architecture and arts. So, the most beautiful time just started, the sun just set, and now you'll have all the lights and the colors just so nicely blend together. <sighs> really excited for dusk and the night. I know there are several reasons why it's more convenient for you to come here during the day. The sunlight, it's warmer, you get to see more, but you really cannot miss out staying at Colmar during the night. Around sunset, the town starts to light up, making the magical spirit of Christmas enchant all the visitors. My favorite time is always during dusk, when the sky is still blue and it's still a little bit bright. That's the moment when the colors are the most intense. I just mentioned before, visiting the Colma market makes you have to explore pretty much the entire old city. But now, which ones are your most important points of interest? I'm going to show them to you one by one. This corner here is called Petite Venice, Little Venice. Well, with the canal, I think you can guess why they named it like this. This is definitely one of the most beautiful places here in Colmar. This is the most popular spot in all of the old city. That corner certainly has something very magical. It's even better, you can go for a boat ride on this canal. 
The gnome is out coming here also during the night. During Christmas season, this corner is even more alluring than in the other time of the year. The next point of interest is in the center of Colmar and that would be his house. It really looks like from a fairy tale. This even more during December with all these wonderful decorations. I even could imagine a fairy living at this house. Just further down the road you can turn to the right and then you'll find yourself in another medieval fairy tale town. So here I show you my favorite corner in Golmach. It's the one with these houses. Wow, that looks really like a perfect Christmassy winter wonderland. I just love looking at these houses. That's certainly one of the most decorated corners during Christmas. In general, I really admire the commitment of the locals of how they try to best present their town during the season. Thinking about the market, it's very good, but in combination with all these wonderfully decorated houses, it really stands out from the others in Europe. Now, how to reach this market? Golmar can be comfortably accessed by train. However, it will take you a while to arrive at the market. In the train station, you will have to walk for about 15 to 20 minutes, passing this beautiful park with this large fountain, crossing the square at where you have some few attractions, and only then you arrive at the city. Also bear in mind, should you again return home by train, to not miss out the last train. Trains might not be always on time, but if you have a connecting train, maybe it's better to take the train before the last one. What a beautiful Christmas market here in Golmar, France. Now if you want to see the most beautiful Christmas markets of Switzerland, then I'll see you in this video. Otherwise, if you're more interested in winter, then I'll see you over there. <laughs>